did someone say Gabriel Knight? And so we will be playing Gabriel Knight today. Let me take off the BRB. I now have some tea. We're ready to go. So, I know nothing about this game. It's a brand new playthrough. I'm probably going to suck epically because I've not played that many um, old adventure games. But someone recommended me I play Gabriel Knight and I saw it on GOG so I was like, why not? Let's play some Gabriel Knight. Um, GOG decided to include DOSBox, so it's running off DOSBox. Awesome. Um, and yeah, so if you see that I'm failing epically, please comment. Well, it'll be awesome. So let's go. Davon. I dreamt of blood upon the shore, of eyes that spoke of sin. The lake was smooth and deep and black, as was her scented skin. Ooh. Oh my! Mm-hmm. I bet. Just a minute. It lives, I see. Do you want to speak with Lolita? So, there's actual voice acting, too? I'm sorry, but Gabriel is allowed. Oh, I mean, he's out. Yeah, if he ever comes back, I'll tell him. You know, you could do better. I know I don't know you, but you could do better. Good morning. The phone's been ringing off the hook all morning. Let me know when you want your messages. Yeah. Gee, you're lively. Did you have another nightmare last night? Sort of. Mm-hmm. I told you it's that voodoo book you're researching. That stuff can seriously screw up your karma. I'm sure that's it. Maybe I should write a horror novel on passive resistance instead. <laughs> <sighs> so don't sleep. It's your body. Anyway, your handheld tape recorder came today. Really? Great! So, I still don't know who I am. Am I the girl or am I the guy? I can't wait to see what human rights you violate with this one. I can't wait to violate them. For example, if you would just let me... I am the guy. Awesome. And I located some local voodoo references for you. Dixieland Drugstore and the Historical Museum of Voodoo. Both are right here in French Quarter. How would I ever manage without you? You? Give me a break. The devil himself couldn't change you. <laughs> well, if the devil had great legs, perhaps, like yours. Oh my. And a riveting personality, I'm sure. Well, if you need any more research done, just ask. It's not as though we're swamped with customers. Clearly, she is my hoe. There's, there's no other explanation for it. Oh, awesome. So I'm assuming this is... The Mag... St. George Books could use some serious renovation, but Gabriel likes to think that the place has character. What? I'm gonna take the tweezers for a bit. Good. You're beginning to look a little scruffy. <laughs> Just trying to make you feel at home. Gabriel cannot see any way to pick that up. So, I don't know why they changed the voice then. Let's just make everything, make sure everything's good. We'll turn the text on so we can actually see what the hell people are talking about. God, I haven't played very many of these, so I have no idea what happens. There's no those. one in that part of the shop to talk to. Okay, so that's the talk button. There's no one in that part of the shop to talk to. And I'm assuming that's asking questions. That's look, that's walk. Gabriel's not interested in opening the books on the table. So that's to open things. Grace would have a fit 
if Gabriel rearranged the books. Okay. So I have no idea what to do here. Um, let's see. There's no one in that part of the shop to talk to. It feels like I'm playing Police Quest again. So, what's new, Grace? Your use of mathematics, for one thing. These books are unbelievable. What can I say? I refuse to be bound by rules. The strap marks on your bedpost speak otherwise. Oh my, she is my hoe. She's gotta be. Okay, let's go. See you later. Uh-huh. So that's the bookshop. We have Dixieland Drugstore, we have St. Louis Cathedral, we have Jackson Square, Jackson Square Overlook, Napoleon House, and Historical Beauty Museum. And then you can go to the New Orleans one. Let's go check out... We'll go check out Jackson. No, no, we'll go check out the Cathedral. Why not? It's the closest one. Oh, awesome! Bike scenes! Aw, I thought you were going to see more than that. That was boring. Okay. Let us go see what's in the cathedral. The chancel of St. Louis Cathedral consists of a raised dais, an altar, two pedestals, and a choir area. Yes, yes it does. <laughs> At least the cherubs are an aesthetic way of asking for donations. So it doesn't sound like there's anything too interesting there. Gabriel cannot go in there. That's the priest part of the confessionals. Okay. Sounds boring. Oh yeah, because I picked up the tweezers. What's this? Ah, we'll find out later. Oh, I'm out in the square. Awesome. The drummer is busy. The other park visitors are enjoying their leisure and aren't interested in talking to Gabriel. I would love to kill this lady. That isn't the one that's talking, I'm assuming. Which one? I don't see one on the one. This one? This lady? Oh. The other park visitors are enjoy- Good for you. Band players, some dude with creepy looking eyes. So I have no idea where I'm going, but we'll find out. Jackson Square Overlook. Oh, that's to pick up. So how do you use? These binoculars aren't... Four pairs of binoculars are... Move, Gabriel. Try to walk, I can't. So, 
How do you use the binoculars? That's what There's I want to no know. One on the There's no animation anymore, that's gay. Let's come here, maybe someone will talk to me in here. What's, What's up? up? Buddy, I think the place you're looking for is down on Bourbon. Bourbon? As in, like, the place I should be going to? So, having a good game? Shh, fine, alright. Hi, how's it going? It's been worse. Hmm. You know, Sam, you're just about the worst chess player I ever knew. Shut up, Marcus. It is. I love how he walks away from the door and then walks up to the door to open it. God, so old school. Let's try going to the historical beauty museum. That's the only place other than this place up here that I've been to, or that I haven't Hi. been to. Look around all you want. Okay, thanks. She does not sound very voodoo-like. Like the lady that's talking to me. The historical voodoo museum is brimming with an official voodoo wish and stuff. Rub it Rub and make it a wish. Make a wish, a card said. Funny, I say the same thing to women. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was awesome! Oh, I love that guy. He's awesome. They might not like it if I move. So that's for moving. I think I found the use button. I wish my voodoo book hits the bestseller lists. That display does. So that's how you use the mechanical function. Historical Thank you, I'm aware. An authentic looking pool marks the center of the room. Authentic what? Yeah. I really the hate that voice. The book critic for the New York Times. He's got more hair than Mosley. <laughs> it's the exit to... I'll be going now, thanks. So long. Peace. Let's go to another place, see what else there is. Well, now that I know how to use things, let's see if I can use the binoculars. Maybe that'll do something. Come on, there we go. Yeah, there we go. I can spy on people now. Oh, hello! So sexy! Hello! Okay, let's go. Am I supposed to be getting that girl or something? Like, uh, what's the girl's significance? I would like to find the girl that you're speaking of. This mime. Can I speak to this mime? Or look at this mime? It's one of those mimes. Oh boy. A Cajun band, inventive as always with their ins- Why you nasty thing you! I'll call the police, I will! <laughs> what do you do? Hey, stop picking on me! I'll tell my dad! <laughs> I said exit. 
She disappears every time I go looking for her. What the hell? Yeah, she's gone. What the hell? Creepy lady. Okay, I think I'm gonna go and check out that last place that I haven't been to yet. This spot. The Dixieland Drugstore. Hi. Uh-huh. The containers on this shelf all say magnetic sand. Magnetic Draw sand? Draw good luck and prosperity. I should probably buy 50 pounds or so for the bookstore. <laughs> Root bags, curio boxes, and magic candles. Sold as curios only. We can guarantee results. So it's all about voodoo, this story, isn't it? Hi there. Is this your store? This is a Dixieland drug store, and I own it, me. Name's Walker. Billy Walker. Mind if I ask you, ask what you want? Can you tell me what you know about voodoo? This is a novelty shop, monsieur. Oh, yeah? What do you know about the voodoo murders? Cabri's sank. What did you say? Nothing, nothing. Those killings have nothing to do with my shop, monsieur. Oh shit. He knows something. What can you tell me about New Orleans? I've lived here all my life, me. What did you mean when you said Cabri sans corps? I didn't say that. You did. I heard you say it. You heard wrong, monsieur. I said no such thing. What does Cabri sans corps mean? Anyone know French? Tell me about yourself. My name's Willie Walker. I own the place. That wouldn't be... Okay, then, um... I think we're done here. We're done here. Where to go next? The only places that are actually lit in color are these two. Bourbon Street. Please But nothing is on Bourbon Street. That's what the other guy said before. Let's go to the bookshop and see if I can ask what's his name questions. Lucy, a uh home. -huh. I wish you wouldn't wear that coat outside in June. I could smell you from here. <laughs> Got a minute, Grace? What's up? What can you tell me about voodoo? I didn't know much of anything about it. Until you started researching it for your book. Now I know that it's active in the city. There's that shop and museum. It can clearly be dangerous in the wrong hands. You should be careful investigating it. What do you know about the voodoo murders? Just what I read in the paper, same as you. What can you tell me about New Orleans? Well, I've only been here two months, but I love it. It's so much more alive than any place I've been. It feels like anything's possible here. So now we know that he's writing a book about it. Do you know what Cabri Saint Gar means? Hmm. No. Sounds French, though. Duh. Tell me about yourself, Grace. Yeah, right, Knight. I mean it. What do you want to know? Ho oh, ho ho, this is gonna be fun. Um How come we haven't gone out yet? I'm still waiting around for that lobotomy. As soon as I get it, I'll let you know. <laughs> How do you like working at St. George's Books? Well, it's not exactly a huge intellectual challenge. Although the math in your record books could confuse Einstein. 
Still, I love old books, and it's a nice way to pay the bills while I explore the city for a summer. If you ever pay me, that is. Alright, nothing. Nice. Suit yourself. You're boring. Uh, messages. Do you have messages for me? Dana called, and uh, Susie left a message about a lawsuit. Awesome. Okie dokie. There's more when you want them. Could you do some research for me? Sure. What? Oh, I can. so I can okay. get her to research things. Okay. Can I pick up this magnifying glass? Mind if I borrow them? No, Sherlock. No problem. Awesome. The books on the table have been chosen for their special... Oh. Hey, kids. Bruno. How nice. Gee, a customer. Of yours? Hardly. How's the flower business? Well, better than the used book business, I see. Rare books. Ooh. That explains why I so rarely see anyone in here. Are you going to sell me that wonderful painting of yours today? 